Alright people, welcome back to a, another War Ale video, um, however, this isn't going to be an episode, this is going to be a tutorial, uh, reason being is because I recorded this session, my turn as you can see is the end of the year, but unfortunately I forgot to use microphone audio, so, um, could not use that. So instead, I'm just going to give you a summary of what happened. Uh, basically, I raised this entire peninsula right here. Next guy should take over um, these next three goblin sites and keep on expanding. The reason why we want to do that is so we can get more war animals like bears and elephants and stuff. Uh, because the elves only come once a year. Um, however, it is spring. So when you get on, whoever the next person may be, remember to... Um, Trade with the elves, and when you trade with the elves, give them a surplus of goods. Maybe I even offer them some stuff because they, the next time they'll come back, they'll bring more stuff if they're pleased with the trading. Uh, besides that, I also made um, some more steel armor, like a bunch of it, a surplus of it. Uh, also, we got the little well system here. This well right now is forbidden, so they can't take water out of it and just throw it in the air and just have a cycle. They have to take it from the underground water source. So all that I need you to do is I need you to first off um, just fill up this lower chamber and then when this lower chamber is filled up uh, keep this chamber over here filled up then you can unlock the well because if this uh, pond is filled up dwarves won't take buckets and put them in there. Um, with that out of the way, uh, I'll get down to explaining how the lever system works. First off is the surface gate. This lever goes up to the surface gate, which is all the way up here. And it just simply goes right here to this one right here. And closing this locks up the entire fortress unless this one is open. This is the uh, second surface gate, which goes to a lever uh, right here. Um, next up is the cavern pillar gate, which just goes all the way down here, and somewhere around, I think I missed it, right over here, it ties into this one. Uh, after that is uh, this one right here, which was the uh, surge cave access, that one just simply goes to right here. Um, next up is the fungi access bridge, I don't know, no which one that goes to. This goes to the minecart sumper, which is up here. Um, it's an off switch for this minecart sumper, which kills things underneath it, and it's going right here. However, I'm not sure if the off switch actually works. Uh, besides that, we have the magma filler that fills up a pit with magma, but I don't think that's done yet. And uh, besides that, we have the grinder levers. The grinder lever off correlates to Uh, this bridge right here, or wait, no, no, grinder level off goes here, grinder lever on correlates to this one, and then the hallway one just correlates to these two bridges here, and if we go down here, you can see them, hallway, on, and off, I've got those bridges labeled in case you need a reference. And that should be all the levers complete, um, if you want to look at the magma filler it's kind of down here um we've got some dude made this uh system here basically i guess it takes uh things from the screw pump pumps in here and uh i think this chamber right in here needs to be expanded although there is this bridge here so i think what that bridge might no well, no because that lever is off and that would mean that this bridge would be open so it doesn't open that bridge um, I'm not, still not entirely sure what that uh, filler lever does, but it is hooked up to some stuff, but when I flipped it on, it didn't do anything. Um, however, what I do know is that lava goes from here, goes into the minecart, goes all the way up here, goes up here, and then gets dumped off here for some reason. Uh, so, yeah. Um, obviously, this is going to be like... 
like just the first video there will be an updated video once you know more mechanisms are added more complication more contraptions uh, if we go up here we might even be able to see that there is a um Okay, come on, get up a little bit. Okay, I think I just went right over it. This is, I believe, going to be a demon killing area. It's just going to be a lava cast. I'm not completely certain on that. Uh, so yeah. The, once this is completed, though, it will add a lot more complexity to the lever system. So this will be a continual series for how to work this confusing fortress.